Welcome to this video. What we will do to begin this task is I'm going to ask you to play as a student. You're going to play the student role to submit some work um, so that then you can go grade that work as a teacher. So you're going to put on your student hat and I'm going to show you how to do that. First thing you want to do is from your dashboard make sure you go into the Canvas course that you're playing in. Your I, I call it your playground where you're um, testing out all the items that you're learning about. You have some assignments here. What you want to do is take a look over here on your right and you should see at the very bottom a button that says student view. If you have um, different browser setup or different um, screen resolution this button might be at the very bottom of your screen. So it's either on the right or the bottom but you want to go into student view and you're literally going to put on your student glasses and this will let you see what a student would see at this moment. Now if you look here and you don't see any of your assignments that's because either they're not published or the unit they're in is not published so you may have to take off your student glasses and go publish them um, so that you can see them as a student so this is what a, a child would see when they come in your class what you want to do is find an assignment um, that is a text entry assignment this does not work well um, student view does not work well with your google drive because google drive gets confused about who you are when you're kind of playing as two different people so go to an assignment that does not require um, the Google Drive. Um, and when you get here, this is what they would see. They would see a, a submit assignment. They would see your que your questions here. And I want you to act like a student. Hit submit. And I want you to answer these questions. Right. And as you are done typing, then you will submit that assignment. And you have just played the role of a student in your own class. So go give that a try in your Canvas Playground class.